Hi friends. I've been thinking about Joshua from the Old Testament. In fact, I even am wearing my little compass necklace today that has kind of become my symbol for that story and for my own uh, remembrance of a season that was difficult and challenging. See, in the books of Exodus and Deuteronomy, it records Moses' life and leadership leading the people of Israel, but at the end of Deuteronomy, it records Moses' death. And then, in the next book, Joshua chapter 1, God charges Joshua with leadership. And throughout the first few verses, over and over again, he says, be strong and courageous. He says it in verse 6. In verse 7, he says it again, only be strong and very courageous. And then at the end of that passage, in verse 9, he says, Have I not commanded you, be strong and courageous. Do not tremble or be dismayed, for the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. See, courage isn't the lack of fear. It's moving forward even when you have fear. And Joshua was facing this crazy season. He didn't know how things were gonna work out. He didn't know every right decision to make. And God didn't ask him to know everything. God didn't ask him to know how it would work out or exactly what he needed to do moment by moment. All the Lord commanded him was to be strong and courageous because the Lord was with him. And so as we face this reality of COVID-19, I believe that God says the same to us. Be strong and courageous. Do not be dismayed or terrified, for the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. Now, there's not a lot of going in these days, but as we make decisions about how we spend our moments, our hours, our lives in this season, we can know that the Lord is with us. We can take steps of courage, not because there's no fear or worry there, but because we know that God is with us. So friends today, I encourage you to be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid, do not be dismayed or terrified for the Lord your God is with you and will be with you wherever you go.